Hello everyone, welcome to another Corbett Gaming Achievement walkthrough and long play. This is Life Expectancy, bringing you a 100% achievement guide for So Many Me on the Xbox One. Following through this video, you should be able to get the full 1000 gamer score in around 4 to 5 hours, maybe slightly longer depending on if you struggle with some of the platforming elements. Overall, it's not a super difficult game and you can replay any and all levels as many times as you need to get all of the collectibles and unlock all of the achievements. There are only a handful of achievements that are not directly related to progressing through the story and getting 100% completion on all the collectibles, and I will point those out as we go along when they come up in the various levels. Thanks for watching. I'm not going to be doing a complete uh, narration of the entire video as I don't think that's necessary due to the fact that most of the platforming is pretty self-explanatory from watching the video. One thing I will note, as I was showing there just now, is the chain jumping. Now, you can get an ability where um, it's called a friend in need, where every time you place a block, um, even if you're down to your last me, you can still place a block in the air, and when you do that, whatever your most recently placed one was will get reeled in. However, some of the uh, platforming puzzles require you to do something known as chain jumping, or at least that's what I like to call it, and that is where you jump, Press Y to reel in your most recent me, and then press X again immediately after reeling it in to place another block higher up in the air. This is especially important earlier on in the game before you get said um, a friend in need ability. However, there are some of the later puzzles that will still require you to do this chain jumping because you might need to leave um, blocks in certain places and then still uh, chain jump up to a, a platform without placing multiple blocks and really in the most recent one because you'll need to get up to a, another spot with two or three or four of your me available. So keep that in mind, learn how to chain jumps. Pretty, pretty, really pretty easy. Uh, it's just jump and then Y and then X. So it's A, Y, X, A, Y, X. Pretty simple to do. Other than that, it's a pretty straightforward game, as I said. Pretty straightforward uh, long play here. I may have to break it up into two videos. Um, if you're listening to this and it is a single video, disregard. But I'm having some struggles with my uh, movie editing software tonight. I've been trying for three days to get this video compiled into one single continuous video. But um, the file size is really large. It's about five gigabytes. And I'm struggling to get that to compile without corrupting. So if I'm unable to do that, I may split it up into two videos, but it shouldn't be any more than two videos. Thanks again for watching, everyone, and have yourselves a wonderful day.
Thank <laughs> you.